COP28 is my fourth COP, and uh, it has tremendous positive uh, point that I can I can mention compared to other three COP that uh, I attended. It has first of all excellent organization. The welcoming spirit, the hospitality of UAE people is top notch. Warm hospitality. And it was my first time to come to Dubai and I'm so impressed. You did a great job, guys. Yeah. The launching of uh, Loss and Damage Fund on the first day, I mean, it is like the first hour of COP was a breakthrough. It is the first COP where such decision was taken the first day. And of course, um, we look forward to more, uh, to more funding, pledges, and those pledges that were already announced should be implemented to bring our expertise. As you know, we have our National Green Fund, our Rwanda Green Fund, which has really changed lives of people through funding of different projects, public projects, private projects, non-governmental organizations, projects. We have that small contribution that we can share will help us not only to, to get partners, and we got partners with whom we signed, who are ready to take the journey with us, but it will help us also to keep decarbonizing our activities, to make sure that our country becomes a net zero nation and a resilient uh, country. And of course, we are ready to, to keep the momentum of having a clean and a green nation and a carbon neutral uh, Rwanda. And of course, we need the partnership. People who are ready to partner with us on that journey of decarbonizing the planet of ours because we have only one planet. There's no planet B.